No, my friends, it is time now to face the real challenge in the real way. Let's see how this goes. This is a walkthrough, and I'm not going to read the lines, but you can read it yourself if you already know what happens and just want to see the run or how I would approach it. You can just Skip it ahead because we will have the timestamps going on. There is he. Okay. Mistranslation. He's never gonna hear it, so what is the first thing that Yurosko is going to do? Okay, so we just entered the dark mirror for the first time and see a uh, destroyed harmonia.
Okay, it's time to start our first run of the Dark Mirror on this final release. We can talk to the witch. We start. The way you can jump here and uh oh, I missed. You can stand on the platform just where the painter <laughs> uh, died. On level zero, the game is like if it is as it at its easiest, but also you have uh, zero benefits from the extras. Like you cannot check, you start with two items. You do not start with extra skulls or choices or anything. You just go very raw, and uh, it's. You're just into the Dark Mirror, just the uh, hard mode, and that's about it. So you do get the choice, the choice between three items. Like none of this is good. I'll get the sword be just because it deals damage from afar. Which, even though it's just like every 13 seconds, and apparently the counter didn't like us. It's the rare, so it will sell for the highest as we go into the shop because yeah since we couldn't start with our treasure we need some way of making money happening girl this early is not what we really want to see but i just took five hits so maybe you know it's not what we want but maybe it's what we need who knows if we don't speak to her right now, she will show up again later. But I'll just take this for 25 guaranteed HP. Ah, uh, it's 50. Okay. This was nerfed. It's not 60 anymore. It's 50. But still. And it's not great to see this early, but like. This is our first first lead in the game. Uh, in this mode. Bait is over. And uh, we just reset, of course. This is my beta save, I just edited so we see everything from scratch, hopefully hopefully I didn't break anything, uh, but we'll find out. Uh, so yeah. We could go for a skull room. Let's just start with these and see how where this brings us. Maybe it is a skull only room run. Uh, maybe it's not. I still don't know. I still cannot tell. I will not force a skull only run because since we don't have the benefits of good starts, we will take some damage and uh, not fight our items, and uh, it gets a bit frustrating. And uh, yeah, I've tried this run already, ended up with a mix of crappy... I would not reroll in case we see good skulls. Uh, I, like, a mix of a failed overrun run, a failed rapidity run, and just died to the hero. So yeah, I'm not that invisible player that I like to pretend that I am. <laughs> this is good damage really. It's 30% in both it increases attack, uh, max HP by 20 and gets dual, two dual already. Two dual is great against bosses. Okay, so another cutscene. So the strange cat thinks everything is strange. Well, we can buy the basics here like Carly and Staff or Spirit Death in case we do see Oberon. Or we can reroll. I'll take this and reroll. I will not go in. Uh, if we see the treasure item, we pick the treasure item and move. In case you haven't seen this cutscene, this explains why we have those rooms and the assistance and why the heroes are weak.
So yeah, the idea is just that he just uses a very powerful technique, which then drains all his energy, so he leaves the combat, but the spell is still here, which calls his energy, and whatever. So that's why you see him outside and you can kill him, but also, ouch. Yeah, um, one thing by the way, you see the air, air on top, it's, it's the bull. If you're not familiar with the inscription, I'm changing my mind on it. I believe it's a strong inscription for this hard mode specifically. And skull, good skull. We could grab this item, I'll just grab the quintessence because it deals damage. And skull is a good skull, really. And because it's a power skull, we would take less damage. Let's just start with, uh, with the skull start and uh, see where this goes. We are strong, because uh, uh, by having only one skull, because swap abilities, we lose the, uh, the power of that. But it's fine. Let's see where this brings us. Stable quintessence. Don't underestimate it. It's definitely okay. Unique item, and it's are we trying another run or are we trying a courage run? This is a, this is good physical and. It's also second treasure. I'll take this for the treasure. Could have been an, an Uber run. Definitely. Maybe. Absolutely. Positively uncertain that it's an, a viable choice. But come on. Uh, I will take the two treasure. Now we have go for this. Could grab courage. Could, could swip, swap with the monkey. Is this the slime? Okay, the slime is a very good one as well. We have nothing here. Could take this for more crits, and because it is more gold in the long run with the insignia, I will not heal for three. And I don't think. Well, let's see. Nope, not worth it. More items. The slime, the uh, the skill of jumping. It, it has zero cooldown, which is yeah, and makes us invincible. And it cooldown, the cooldown is very quick. Even without heritage, it could even get quicker as we. Turns our way, so maybe it is a good essence uh, that I've never used in my life. <laughs> because if you, uh, I, I used when I was a beginner, but I've been watching business content and just like doing these in level nine during the beat and such. And uh, yeah, uh, slime is the invincibility specifically is very powerful. It's invisibility on the stick, and if we do find the items that trigger, it could have been another one. I'll, I'll, I'll grab it just in case we find another fairy tale item. The run is still very early in the game, and we don't have any idea what the correct way of building it. We cannot force anything, we don't have this ability. But I'll just take advantage of the the treasure that we have and uh, I move the bits. I will not go down there for the healing. Not worth it. So yeah. As you can think of of I'm as a fairy. I just 
we don't have to time very well. This needs to be earlier than the hero, uh, than the tank, and that's it. Going to the Yggdrasil fight. And uh, yeah, Yggdrasil at level 0 has about 1200 HP, so should be fine to deal with. Really? Um, yeah, the things that change with Yggdrasil, you've seen in the beta videos, is just. This, these rocks and it, and, uh, and uh, these spikes but unless I do something very wrong we should be able to do, do a quick work of this phase yep and, uh, the arms just helped a bit there. We have our 15% amplification from the Ooh, description. Again, I believe it's good. Even slime did a death like 100 damage because of that. And uh. Okay, there goes a perfect Yggdrasil fight. <laughs> and this is an interesting choice. On non seed, we're never, never swapping if we keep the Hero Slayer. Got a sword, will mean more arms, more treasure. Burst Pauldrons, very good item. I recommend this in hard mode if you need the help. I think maybe we are strong enough that we don't need to go with it. I will grab treasure just in case we do end up like for treasure. Could do this for revenge as well, but this increases physical damage. And maybe we end up like physical skull. I still don't know where is our direction. But here we end up facing each other in this realm. So keep watching. Okay, so this is our first exposition to Dark Abilities. Uh, we have... OCD sounds okay. I don't want this right now. Boost, I think it's uh, a bad uh, translation. It's just Amplify. But yeah, basic attack damage. Amplify by 10. It's fine, Super Baby. I I believe that's the most important Dark ability in the game, really. King Slayer now is very expensive. Achievement, it's just okay. This is not great for bosses and we need help against bosses, really. So, 
It is perfectly valid to not use some, but since we can destroy them, we can like get something and then change. We can grab these two, so if we are close or far, we will deal damage. And it's like okay. Other options are like very bad. Oh yes, then let's say grab super baby and uh, move on. Three hundred eight HP. I forgot to keep the message so you could read it. Arachne is there. Wait down. Uh, if we try to upgrade her. stronger it's like the most like simple detail it's like you can't upgrade the skull not because he never been stronger like in the in normal mode but because he, he is the strongest already okay uh, the act 2 uh, the first exposition that we get for two hard enemies are these shields they are fairly okay to uh, evade but they are invisible from the front always they don't get like exposed or anything so you always have to backstab them the, yeah they are dangerous but you, learn, you can learn how to evade them fairly quickly really See what our item is. More uh, some rapidity, more arms, or this. I'll grab rapidity because it is heritage and it is go down for slime. Maybe we can do a slime run. with uh, something like Heritage and Nobaran would be very fun like we can force any strategy really again we don't have the ability here to just go crazy oh, I tried to evade in time but Anyway, this is a free room. You, if you fall, you cannot go go back. So you go here and grab some treasure. These rooms are okay as a, as a breather because you just get free stuff. But in as hard mode progresses, you actually don't want to see free rooms because free rooms never have elite enemies those dark card hearts enemies that drop you stuff that you can use in those realms between levels and they are essential if you want to have a build really I will I wanted to do the slime thing but off demon is just like very 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 good item I would I'll take the magic item, I will take this in case. Yeah, let's start getting rid of physical stuff because Yeah, I Yeah, I I believe that 
this is a better treasure and this is also antique if we get two antique we will get more HP really so let me reroll this more the we could grab uh, the Manatec Rarity Generator but now that we have zero physical damage it's not that good I want a better uh, item with dual though I still want dual I believe it is good and uh, I still don't know if we can fit a number one run here but why I picked Arc Demon I'll show you now The only thing that's right was a shield because he was invincible from the front. But our demon is just very, very, very good for cleaning rooms. He just carries us, he will carry us like until the bosses. Because since the bosses have so much HP in hard mode, even level 0, he will be hard to just kill everything. Oh look, nothing here is good, so we will just move on. Everything is rare, so they will sell for the same thing, so we can let the system sell this for us. And uh, yeah, we took some damage already, uh, but like for the HP that we have, it's fine. We have our demon, let's spawn everything, go back for 3 healing orbs, awesome. Some gold, some gold, and uh, some more elite, and some more adventures. Uh, as we go into the second adventure fight, it is just like the level 1, uh, on the normal mode I mean. We have 2 adventures, but we all adventures until Act 4 are going to have an assist. So, just like our last fight that we had one, this is going to be the same, so we are going to see the same animation. But now we have two enemies to take care of. The right Jenkins. Okay, we couldn't prevent the ultimate by just using our skill because our skill is weak without everything that you need to make the skill not suck. So yeah, ouch. Uh, we are going to take another ultimate. So I'm going this way. So Arc Demon just deals a lot of damage. The ouch, I tried to give him one, didn't have time. Okay, let's see if they drop some healing. I think their loot was reduced from the beta because, like, they're dropping way less. <laughs> okay, you know how much I love playing with the Reaper. And harvest is like my favorite skill. Gnome could mean it is a fairy tale run with skull. It doesn't need to be a skull run. Uh, let's just do a fun Reaper run and keep moving. Now we don't need to go to rooms at all anymore. We can just go here, pop our demon and the uh, harvest and uh, yeah we want everything to die so we get more souls. Because soul uh, Reaper is like the one of the best legendaries for hard mode because you will just not take damage. Because harvest becomes invincible. Yes move here and also I don't like creating by the way if we can just 
swap into system servers. Combo is way better for me. But anyway, as I was saying, uh, the thing about Reaper is that every time, every soul that you take is one percent more HP, uh, magic damage dealt. So we will never like need many offensive items. So it means that you can deal a lot of damage, but also invest in defense, so you just don't die. Don't just die. I mean. Okay, I swapped into skull and we might lose our first life, so I will wait like a coward because I don't want to die with a Reaper. Reaper uh, guarantees uh, souls when you swap into him, but also it is harder though to do such a thing. Let's see if our demon can do a good job for us. Of course, he can. We get our two hearts, which is the last elite in this act guaranteed uh, because it's a dark mode zero. This is uh, unique, we have 6000 gold, so no matter how hard this is. Ouch. Uh, no, no. Yeah, that was uh, a bit too much. <laughs> I, I will try not to die. If it. Yeah, this is going to cost a lot. But I'm not going to die. Yeah. We have the treasure here. I will open this and it's bad, so we lost gold. But again, I wasn't going to die with this. So, I'll heal for the little that we can. This is okay. This is the point where we just know that Oberon is not going to happen. So let's just take this and reroll. Nice determination. Very good defensive item. I will take this over the thing here. Could be okay. Won't take it. This is like the best wisdom item. Like I will take this over this dual item. Though I'll take this over the... I still want to duel, really. Even though this is a bad duel. Let's go for more stuff. <laughs> we got all four in a single sweep. Also, this is very reaper -y. Uh We do want some skillful damage speed so we can spam our harvest. Because as we get closer to 50, on 50, we just go full matrix on it, pull the time and hit the entire room. <laughs> so we just stay invincible as we hit hit multiple enemies all at once. Oh look. It's back. But no. Exponal tanks. We are still in the skull mode, so ouch. We can trigger nothing here by just jumping in. Ah, we trigger the. Let's swap in. So we did we not get two souls or was it just fast? Anyway, we want to kill everything. And the. Uh, okay, I'm not going to take that damage. For yeah, something that's not there. Against the sisters, the plan is the same. Just obliterate everything. But also, uh, if we kill the first sister, we get 30% more damage to this for the first sister because that's how the uh, I just forgot the name of the item. Stone of the hair works. Let's pop our demon, and uh, that's a good timing. Let's rip and fail. 
Yeah, the damage here is very Reaper. That's why we picked the legendary. And uh, we do want the. the two. wisdom because it will amplify the damage that we get from the Reaper. Currently only 33, but we should get around 200 by the end of the run. Maybe. Maybe. Like. this thing. Just stay in front of her. Uh, you won't get hit here. This year, uh, dash out or dash in to her, or dash out and dash in. That's my favorite strategy. Invincible, the Dark Demon. Uh, yeah, you can see the Stone of the Air uh, icon. Uh, already has one, sister is dead. Got your soul, or as Shinsam would say, your soul is mine. Okay, prison. We're not doing this. Troll is okay, but we are not doing this. I'm just going to sell troll for ten, which it wish with the super baby is twelve. HP and keep moving. Let's check this. Let's see. Agreeably, Bruce try. It's not good. Nope. We should curse. We're not doing that much quintessence stuff. Weak name's exposure was heavily nerfed. This year will work. But that's because we will not do. Uh, we will not be able to have cooldown over under two seconds with Reaper. So I will take this. The next level is three. This le the next level for three. This is four. Uh, we could try these. Like with Reaper and Hawk and uh, Arc Demon, Hawkeye actually works. Let's try Hawkeye then. This circle is the Hawkeye circle, so anything that is inside will take normal damage. Anything that is outside will have amplified damage taken. We're gonna get to let the Lord Beast go, so sorry about that. You can go back and pause the video. Uh, yeah, I don't like guillotine. And I'm not afraid to edit it. <laughs> it's just so slow. As now, as of now, we are only dealing damage like close, so Hawkai looks horrible. But I'll show you when we got in four more souls. I will stop so we have more chances of doing this whole thing. Magic Pocket Watch is just like. Antique is good. Uh, I just want a duo item to replace this, really. These are okay. I, and I still think there's value in the two uh, treasure because it is amplified the gold by 50% because we have a legendary with stone mask. So let's just keep going here. And uh, let's. Yeah, as we now got the, the full. That's why we want Hawkeye. <laughs> we just simplify damage to everyone. And here is just utility. We're okay. We can call the guillotine and move out. It's fine. Everything is fine. But yeah. Level 0, it is challenging more than it was in the beta. Because it is harder, because the abilities are very, like, were heavily nerfed this year. Okay, Quintessence, I'll just pop this and uh, do the harvest and uh, yeah. This year, wood 
uh, in the beta destroy for 30 but the dev said no that's too much so they reduced to 15 but still 15 free HP we take these I will heal though just for safety don't even care about don't side or anything I just reroll a few times since we do have the the stone mask we can afford that but rebels are very expensive now by the way heirloom is wisdom could be a good mirage I just want a good dual item really. and uh, yeah we cannot afford anything else so yeah that's why I appreciate other items more now for instance the ability of just as the hard mode progresses, just get more stuff from different. Now I need to get rid of the sword. Is this a treasure item? Maybe we can try to see what. Yeah, and it's a unique wood statue. Is heirloom? Is better than the, this? Though, uh, yeah. Let's just do this and see what we get. Really. Alternatively, we can say I don't want to duplicate specific items like Carlyan Staff, I don't want two of these or the Carly Insignia So I will, instead of replace, let's say the Insignia here and destroy this So now we know that we will have one Insignia if we need it but it's not going to be duplicated Okay, a princess box is too dual, so it's okay. We will now have to consider can we afford? It? You know what? This is good, this is okay, this increases our chances of dealing more skill damage, but we don't need it. I just want to get treasure and a lot of rebels that do nothing. The yeah, Earth Demon, doing Earth Demon things, and then we do Harvest things, and the uh, entire room is gone. I think, yeah. Going into the Heroes fight, again, three heroes, just like normal mode, but the three, uh, not heroes, adventures, I mean. And the three adventures will have uh, a helper. In this case, the ninja. So the ninja will summon clones and set up and, and do shuriken stuff. But we can do the creeper stuff. I, I, I wanted to have some heritage so we could get some better cooldown for our demon, but it's fine. I, I still don't like. Uh, Yeah, the flame is to indicate that you cannot amplify skill damage again, but like, until it's, done, it's gone, but again, you can see our cooldowns are so slow, that even if we, and the animation from Harvest is so fast, it's so slow as well, so, even if you, okay, this is now a free mage mana bracelet. Are we passing it again? Or are we ready to get rid of the treasure? Because it is to her long. It is wisdom. Maybe we don't need the fence anymore. Yeah, let's do this. Let's be greedy. Sometimes greed pays off. Oh, we even got a soul here for free. Again, uh, late game when it's harder this is value for now we can just maybe get for wisdom which is great amplification so we will do that instead yeah for wisdom right now is we have 570 percent damage it's going to go greatly up as we hit our first enemy you will see uh, let's go here and do the 
Okay, 826. Wisdom, it, for wisdom is this good. So yeah, I I shouldn't have box art even here. It was a waste of Aquintess as well. It's fine. Invisible knife, it's fine if you are dealing multiple hits and many of them can be crits at this st state. We don't want that. We do want this though. Phantom is an okay quintessence, but I don't. Huh. So we have the this skull, so we can go extra stealthy. I just teleporting. this and by the map you can see where the devices are because they're oh no yeah yeah die all thanks for your souls now that we are here let's just have this for nothing bones not not having values value in early game, feels so bad when you get a legendary. But it's like it's great what they did on the hard mode, on the altars. So yeah, you'll see that if you haven't seen yet. Yeah, I reset a lot of dialogues. Thanks for your father's gifts. I will just destroy it in front of you. <laughs> 14 HP. Anyway, we're full health. And uh, we go here, and it's uh, a lot of not good stuff. Blue. It's wisdom. Not the best wisdom that we can get, so we just move here. Clone. No. Clone stand, by the way, now gives 40% physical and magic attack, so it's great. But we don't need dizziness. Just reroll here until we find something, or just decide that nothing is good. Nothing is good! So let's keep going. I will just pop here, and uh, keep moving so everything that spawns dies. You die too. Amplification again, very powerful effect. I do want some cooldown. Maybe I did want the wood statue. At some point, we will get rid of the stone mask, though the 50% uh, boost in. Everything is great. Oh, uh, in every gold game. Clone stamp is also Disney. Uh, I, I wish they fixed this so we could get more consistent. Ouch. I, I lost a lot of souls here because I swapped out in, in panic. Let's just harvest these ones instead. Okay. Let's see what this room brings us. There's a lot of enemies that are going to die quickly. Because we are the Reaper. And the Reaper is awesome. Which means we are awesome. You are awesome, you know? Maybe you are. I appreciate you and everything you've been doing for me, watching these things and uh, commenting and subscribing, doing all the YouTube thing, but also going on the Discord, Discord and uh, interacting. We're a fairly small community, though the game did go relatively mainstream. But yeah, I enjoy the company and I enjoy the interest in my. 
big old stuff that we can do. So let's uh oh. we we almost killed the camera without Yeah, didn't need to do that. Uh, I wanted to show something, but it didn't work. Because the camera, specifically on that move, you can just uh, jump up and go through the beams, but you need to be close to the camera. We have now three on Stone of the Air. Camera's poison on fan. Interesting item, but not great for us. I'll just keep going bulky just to go to the hero. Very, very thick, I guess. These two are not good for us. We have only two. I, uh, we can hold to try and grab Kingslayer to kill the hero, or we can Im improve our. So strike, so strike. Yeah, we will hold to um, to improve our so strike. So yeah, this just confirms we are in another world, not the same one. Just parallel realities or whatever. We do want to replace broken man engine though. It's kind of we can do better skill cooldown. Oh look, we can invoke Arc Demon while doing cool uh, We haven't seen. Uh, Reroll and see it. The one that we didn't interact was very early in X1, I think. These guys are dead, just like everything. I guess the Reaper, because the Reaper is awesome. And we are getting close to 150. And at 150 souls, we evolve once more. I think I don't know if traps I think traps don't trigger during uh, yeah you, we got zero souls from killing 50 enemies so you don't want to use these with Kirin or Reaper or anything that counts the deaths so I will just instead use your quintessence and uh, you see how many souls now and now that we have 165 souls we are ready for Absolutely total destruction. Oh, we had some some there. We could oh I, oops. Yeah, we never get souls from these, I think it's wrong. Uh, but yeah, anyway. Is this dual? It is dual. It's also execute. And uh, yeah, it's better than this, so we will replace. We don't need bone. If we find another execute, maybe we will get there. Uh, execute is also it's good amplification, really. Uh, I don't I don't know if you can tell from. The, okay, I'll just do mana sack infinite bone instead. Infinite bone. I believe it's time for the stone mask to go. Thank you for your service, but. We now can do infinite bone stuff with Reaper, which means we can harvest, and if we're lucky, we can harvest again. But who needs it because everything is dead. Guillotine is such a bad skill. Uh, harvest though. And uh, yeah, heritage. It would be okay with our Arc Demon, but we are okay waiting, really. Let's just keep moving and uh, do the cool report thing. Which is 
destroying everything. Whenever we let's oh we can we took damage so we can heal. And uh yeah, let's do this here and uh Yeah, infinite bone hasn't um good work for us yet. But at least we have fifteen more for the remaining support. You're inside my circle. You're inside protection. It's, it's just like the quarantine. Oops. Description. But, oh, no description. The, okay. Yeah. This is the long layout of the act. This is taking a while. It's good for farming gold and uh, items if you find uh, item tools. But yeah. Um, we haven't so no no legendary items for us. Okay. Yeah, I don't like the team. We get vulnerable, we stay vulnerable for a long time. I like doing the, these two together though. You can just call your thing and pause time. So the thing, the enemy will move. And enemies that don't move, take more damage. The team is showing it. Doing its best impression of a bad skill. This so we look like we're playing a bad, a bad skill. Uh, we can then harvest and uh, everything is good. Even got a soul. Oh, and infinite bomb. So we can harvest it again and again. And then we get changes because it's an easy enemy. And the legendary is nothing good. But you love legendary chests. Now instead of having one bad item, now you can look at three bad items. Uh, as I told you. Huh, did she teleport or something? Anyway, we don't care about this, it's fine. Oh yes, the good old infinite bomb guillotine that everybody loves. Now we can suck. 30% of the time, it will suck forever. Yeah, if you haven't noticed, I don't like Guillotine. <laughs> it's fine that yeah, we have the best though. Let's see, no item. I believe they reduced the item drops by a lot. Let's get 5 HP. And uh, just keep moving. And uh, skull rooms, we don't have any use for that. We will double jump and uh, completely miss. Okay, let's grab our. If we haven't talked to this entity. Okay, overrunning Kai's tea with a lot of ice. <laughs> so let's get our shields and keep moving. Some gold, some items, some harvesting, and some harvesting again. Because infinite bonus, fun.
Okay. These things have a lot of HP, huh? We done like 5,000 damage with our harvesting and the. It's just survived. Give me our souls. Take our the souls I can. <laughs> you reap what you sow. Thank you. Please don't want to subscribe. I promise I won't repeat this but Never again. Oh look! At this point, the most useless X4 uh, NPC in the game. Fireworks? How about? Nope. Dark Paladin is an okay support uh, skull, but we don't need support. We have the Reaper. And the Flory, as you can see, we have a lot of HP. If you are doing physical runs, this is like the dark mode superstar. Hello and mana cycle. We could grab for two mana cycle, but I don't know what to fit it. I don't want to get rid of two duels. Oh, it is the same as mana engine, but uh, will deal more damage, so I will replace this. And because and because now we have two hello. Oh, we have three, uh, so doesn't matter. We have part of greed though. Part of greed is a lot of damage. And uh, a lot of base damage. We don't. I don't want to get rid of duel. Are we getting rid of a cycle? Sure. Huh. Nice new effect for telling you that you get the new item. We don't want this new item though. So let's just keep going with this combination. We didn't find the solo sword, and the slime didn't give us the second moon item, but it's fine. Really, really fine. The hunter is here, and uh, ouch. Yeah, playing this game with some, without some of the benefits the hard mode, later hard mode are going to give us. Just feel like I'm playing a very underpowered version of myself, and it, it kind of sucks. Like after you experiment through power, it's just like I'm playing a reduced version of the game. So yeah, I kind of sympathize with the people that like just don't want to play hard mode maybe because it's too hard for them but like and the, the the unlockables would be good for them but they cannot do the they cannot unlock because they are not that good at the game and they cannot be better become better at the game by just oh i mean the game cannot be easier for them because they can yeah it's a uh, it's kind of a, a loop that I barely explained. So let's try again. These people want to have fun playing with all the unlockables in the game. Especially this early because they're not that good at the game. And, but did, did someone say sentence harvest? Let's pop this first. Ouch. Anyway. Yeah, this meteor strike is just annoying. Uh, please. Sentence and uh, Fisher. I'll take. This is Sentence and Fisher again? No, Guillotine and Fisher, even worse. Guillotine and Sentence. Harvest and Fisher. I'll take this. We can't. Uh, Fisher at least does a lot of damage and like guillotine. So, artifact and take. Okay. Items. Don't need them. 
we are currently doing 1057. <laughs> uh, damage, which, if you have noticed, is a lot. It's a. And as we will pop our for fourth boss and also get the extra wisdom, it's going to be even more. Yeah, one is gone. And Fisher, we can just pop and see it destroyed. Yes, it's worse with our Soul Strike, but we have Harvest for everything else. And we also have Infinite Bomb, so Phase 1 is gone. Let's go. Let's see if <laughs> Phase 2 of uh, Joanne fares any better against Reaper. Remember, we have the incentive of keeping her outside our circle, so we will amplify more damage. We can do the Fisher, and we can do another Fisher, and just see her speed bar out. Okay, another Fisher, and let's do our demon things as well. And two minus that. Let's see what is our reward. Okay, Wisp against the hero might be better than. Archdemon, because Wisp means we can do Harvest, and if Infinite Bomb di didn't trigger, we can Wisp and then do Harvest again, which gives us another chance of giving, getting Infinite Bomb. We also get the 15 HP from Archdemon, though, oh no, it's more, it's more damage to keep Archdemon because it's legendary and we only have 4 legendaries with Port of Creed, oops. Yeah, I will keep the damage. And now we have four, so we can get another super baby, we can get another soul strike and maybe one thing that costs one, which would be... Nothing really. This here, maybe, counter attack. We don't want shorthand. Or we can just get grab Kingslayer. Let's just grab Kingslayer. Uh, the hero that'll die at 10. And uh, yeah. Okay. More for you. And uh, let's face the hero. With wisdom, our damage now is 1549. It's going to increase by a bit because we have these things. And the opening multiple fissures does a lot of damage. But yeah, I wish she was sentenced to harvest, but the a hole Dark Priest was an a hole. What a surprise. We don't have money to buy anything here, and we don't care. Shadow Knights. One of the best quintessences in the game, maybe the best to play against enemies' rooms. You just clean the entire rooms with those. And... Wait, does Fisher not trigger? Huh. Uh, do I want to test it? It's just that they die very quickly. Arc Demon, just a demonstration. You can go in between the two and pop. And uh, Arc Demon destroys everything without us needing to touch. So, yeah, I'll show the damage right now 1740. Because this is where we show our build. And in case we didn't get the, to show the 4 wisdom, we should, we should could. So, it's 1740 damage, which is a lot. Even though we don't have much skill now, speed is only 2 to 260. But we have Master Fighter with dual, so we will have 15% uh, 
amplification against the hero. We have four wisdom, which is the amplification that we see now. Uh, infinite bone, which is just great with Reaper because we can just harvest multiple times and just stay invisible. Uh, Arc demon, very good. Uh, uh, very good intestines, really. Part of greed, very gen a good generic item, which is also given given as two antique for. 35 max HP. Uh, for wisdom here, we didn't get the sword sword, so sadly. Mage mana bracelet helps with uh, skill cooldown at some points. Son of hair, hair heirloom, but also 150. Uh, in this case, 100, yeah, 150 uh, percent damage. Princess box just giving us the two duel for the amplification, and yeah. Uh, the, our build, Super Baby, always good. So Strike is interesting with a center harvest build because everything will take more than 2 seconds, so everything is amplified by 20. We could have tried to get 40 or 60, but at level 0 we don't have enough hearts for that. Hawkeye, because harvest, we, are, we just trigger this from afar. And Kingslayer, because yeah, 10% less HP for the hero is okay. We didn't have other good options, and it's okay. Good enough, maybe. So, yeah, this is the entrance of the hero fight. If you haven't seen it. Yeah, it's only that. We can pop. Oh, we didn't go down our demon. Oops. But yeah, as we trigger the duel, the sword on top, and now the hero is permanently taking 15% uh, percent amplification, and with our Haw Hawkeye, yeah, and the uh, wisdom, oh, uh, well, we missed, oops, we can pop here though, yeah, 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 Okay, just get Slate King. Okay, we killed faster than... <laughs> okay. Bring your stun if it's your first time you listening to it. Enjoy. The strategy for this is try to dash. Try not to do this silly mistake that I did. But you can evade stuff with harvest, so just evade stuff with harvest. This has two, and then this we can pop this here. This here is easier than it looks. I don't know if touching the circle there screwed up our chances. Yeah. If it goes horizontal, you wait until it goes at diagonal, and when it goes diagonal, okay, this is. Okay, this move is one of the most unfair in the game. But what else can we do? Right? Just an Arc Demon, so we can't see anything. <laughs> he will do this three times, and uh, this time we got hit by 45 damage. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we will. Yeah, this deals a lot of damage. Uh, and it's like all these grabs are really, really hard to evade. So, uh, but this should be okay. These balls doesn't matter because he's dead. Alright. 355 souls, a lot of damage. 
right now at 1200 without the wisdom but that is our run i will finish this and uh, we'll see the cutscenes on the next video of, of this walkthrough from one to uh, from zero to ten so thanks for watching subscribe to see the next one stay safe